Hi everyone, Catherine here with Catherine's Plate. I just got back from doing a Walmart haul. Now this morning we had planned to go to Aldi. We had stopped at Walmart to pick up a few things that we needed and the weather turned on us and it started raining really bad and so we're just like, well let's just go ahead and get the grocery shopping done at Walmart. So I revamped my list a little bit and you know what? We found some really awesome things there so I'm super excited to show you what we got. So we're going to start with these baby dutch red potatoes a rich buttery flavor i'm going to be using these for a roasted chicken that i'm going to be making i picked up three heads of garlic three bulbs of garlic here i'm going to be putting one whole bulb into the chicken <laughs> so we got that i picked up some blueberries oh, don't those look really good y'all i'm thinking of making some scones with those so we'll be doing that picked up some, these are um, vine ripe tomatoes, so we needed them for salads and also for sandwiches. Now I picked up three herbs here, got rosemary, thyme, and sage, all fresh. This is for my roasted chicken I'm going to be making. Now I can't wait until um, gardening season here in the next two weeks. I'm going to start planting some herbs so I don't have to buy them like this anymore. All right, I picked up thing of carrots. Now we go through a lot of carrots, so I got those. Um, picked up some lemons here because I needed some for my chicken, and also I'm going to be keeping one on hand for um, a dish I'm going to be making next week also. We got some bananas. We got six bananas here for smoothies or slice them on top of cereal. All right, I picked up two zucchini, two squash, and two cucumbers there, and those are for my vegetable bin, which is very low right now and sad looking, so I have to update it a little bit for the week. All right, oh, look what we found in the bakery at Walmart, vanilla brioche. This is a delicate sweet brioche, braided brioche with a vanilla custard filling. Y'all, it is so soft. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to dig into that. Now, we usually get the chocolate brioche from Trader Joe's or Aldi, so I've never seen a vanilla brioche with custard, so I'm excited. We're excited to try that. All right, next we have some cereal in the back. Captain Crunch and Frosted Flakes. I like the Frosted Flakes. They all like the Captain Crunch. Sometimes it's nice just to have some good old sugary cereal in your house <laughs> when the need arises. All right, next we have Kraft American Singles. Okay, we buy that and it disappears. I don't know, but and my husband likes to make grilled cheese sandwiches with those also And then he can add gouda cheese. This is a sliced gouda cheese and then a sliced Havarti semi soft cheese. Okay, we can use these for sandwiches or grilled cheese, too Right next I bought some Grand's biscuits. I'm gonna be doing some kind of monkey bread with that. So stay tuned for that video to the back, I have, oh, uh, well, okay, that was just a, whoop, I found it and saw it and wanted it. <laughs> Tostitos in a Sauce Verde flavor, so I was really excited to tr be trying that one. All right, sour cream donut holes. Uh, I don't know, when you go to Walmart and you're hungry, it all looks good, right? <laughs> so I, that did. All right, next we have artesian bakery bread, Sara Lee. We love this bread, y'all. This is our favorite bread now. I don't know why, but it's so good. I like the flavor of it. And so we use it a lot for toast, sandwiches, and that. All right, next we have some hot dog buns. These are top sliced hot dog buns, bakery classics, and we use those for hot dogs. All right, which are right here. So I got the Nathan's Skinless 8 Beef Franks that we're gonna have this coming week. I picked up some Toll House semi-sweet chocolate chips for a dessert I'm going to be making. I picked up some Jimmy Dean Country Mild Sausage. I'm making a breakfast video, so um, stay tuned for that. It's going to have a lot of good breakfast stuff in it. Next, we got some King Hawaiian Rolls. Now, if you saw my Costco haul, you saw that I bought the double pack. and. Our dog got into one pack while we were away, so she didn't, luckily she didn't eat very much of it, but she did get right through the center of it, so we had to replace that. 
All right, we got flour tortillas because we always have flour tortillas in our house. And we do quesadillas or wrap them with some eggs and sausage. Really good. All right, I had to pick up a thing of real mayo. So I went ahead and got that. Needed some vegetable oil, so I got the Crisco Pure Vegetable Oil. Oh, and they had some nice decorative stuff too for Easter or for the spring. Oh, I really loved that lemon tree because I can't grow one in the house for whatever reason. So, yeah, I just put a fake one in there. <laughs> it looked so pretty. It called my name. I was like, okay, I'm taking you home. All right, and then I got a nice sign there with bloom on it to put into my kitchen for decoration. So I'm really happy about that. All right, next they have a... Um, a medium pizza and since we weren't at Aldi this morning I went ahead and just picked up one of these supreme pizzas here it's just for me and my husband since the kids are gonna be gone while we're eating that so that was plenty right there all right next we have golden crispy crowns I'm gonna be making a take on shepherd's pie using these and it will be a video so stay tuned for that I'm really excited to show you how I'm gonna make that Next, we have three pepper and onion blend. So there's yellow, red, and green peppers, and the white, yellow, well, the white onions in there. So I'm going to be using these when I cook up my scrambled eggs and, and omelets and that. All right, next, I have my ground beef that I'm going to be using for shepherd's pie, and then the other half is going to be made with uh, Swedish meatballs. All right, the last thing I got are these Pioneer Woman dishes. I didn't even know they had these. I, I would just turn around. They were sitting right next to the pizzas. So this is a country fried steak. I'll have the prices listed up here above. I don't have my receipt with me right now, but I'm going to um, put the prices on everything up above. So I have the country fried steak. Now this is just heat and eat. It's a seasoned breaded beef steak with gravy by Pioneer Woman. Oh, I just wanted to try it and see how that, how that was. All right, and she also has sides. And um, this one is the creamy mashed potatoes, heat and eat. Now we also saw like they had macaroni and cheese and they also had um, like a veggie thing where you can put scrambled eggs in it and make that and different, different meats also. All right, y'all, that was my haul at Walmart today. Don't forget to comment down below if you had any favorites here and give me a thumbs up for my haul and also if you're new make sure you hit that subscribe button down below with the bell notification so that you know when all of my hauls are posted and all of my cooking videos are posted all right y'all i'll see you on my next episode